Hello and welcome to this week's episode of CBTV. While the Gillard government faces a growing list of problems within their own ranks, their failures continue on border protection. The most recent illegal boat to arrive here was carrying 135 people. For five years, the Australian people have had to put up with a government that has weakened our border protection laws. Labor have been dragged kicking and screaming into policy changes in a half-hearted effort to stop the boats. Recently, a coalition team of Julie Bishop, Scott Morrison and Michael Keenan returned from a fact-finding mission to Sri Lanka. People coming from Sri Lanka account for the biggest number of boat arrivals to enter Australian waters last year. And it's possible that this number could increase if the reaction to the Prime Minister's election announcement is anything to go by. Reportedly, it made the front page of Sri Lankan newspapers, leading Julie Bishop to comment, there is a perception that this government will let them stay, but a new government will not. Now, people smugglers know that the coalition takes border protection seriously, while Labor, especially under Julia Gillard's watch, is an easy target for people smugglers. After all, in her time as Prime Minister, she's seen over 22,000 people arrive here illegally. And it hasn't stopped. This January saw double the number of boats arrive, compared with January of last year. The Coalition wants to see positive steps taken towards stopping the boats. We'd like to see the government assist the Sri Lankan Navy to intercept more boats before they leave local waters. This could protect lives and ultimately reduce the workload for our own Navy. And while we are all counting down the days to the next election, where we all have the chance to make a positive change for a more secure Australia, the Sri Lankan people smugglers are counting down for a very different reason. Their window of opportunity is shortening, so they are applying their grubby trade as quickly as possible. Another Labor government will mean more of the same. Labor has proven that they cannot be trusted to protect Australia's borders. But a coalition government will implement the tough policies needed to strengthen our borders and to help stop the people smuggling trade. This is Corey Bernardi. You're watching CBTV.